Hi, my name is Joseph Lee. I'm the medical director for Hazelden Betty Ford's Youth Continuum. I'm a child psychiatrist and an addiction specialist. Today I want to have an intimate conversation with you about your loved one and their care. When you get treatment for your loved one for a substance use disorder, you want to make sure that they're not just ceasing drug use or reducing drug use. You want to really understand that the people that are taking care of your loved one understand their development, their risks, their trajectory, and their strengths. And that's what this conversation is about. One of the unfortunate things when we're talking about substance use disorders is that people get overly focused on substances and drugs and not on the kids, not on the individuals, not on the young adults and how they develop and what their trajectory is. When you think about chronic disease models like heart disease or diabetes, there are risk factors that pop up long before symptoms of the disease pop up sometimes year or decades before. In fact, the same goes for substance use disorders. Did you know that you can identify risk factors for substance use disorders in children long before they actually start picking up any drug use? Starting in grade school at the ages of 10 or 11, high-risk youth can be identified. 